Hey YouTube, welcome to another review. Sam here. This time we'll be attacking the house of Nastiso Rodriguez with their unisex scent, which I would call unisex. It's called Essence the Musk Collection. Essence the Musk Collection. So this is the obviously the separate flanker to the original Essence. And the only difference is with the bottles anyway, is that this has got a bit of darkness at the bottom, which is in implying intense, obviously. Um, it's classed as a floral mus a musky scent, um, which is pretty much banging the money, really. That's what it is. It is a floral musk. That is pretty much it on the actual, what it smells like, in a way. Um, I'll tell you what I get, anyway. Um, as soon as you spray it, you get, it's quite an alcoholic mix. Um, after about a minute to about ten minutes, you start to get the florals. Um, it's, the floral is iris and a bit of incense as well. Um, I think there may be vanilla in it as well, but it's not much vanilla. Um, but it's predominantly iris and your incense, which incense could come off as being a florally sort of type of smell. Um, so that's what you get out of it anyway, really. Um, it lasts about seven to eight hours on your skin. Uh, it projects to two or three hours. Um, so it's not too bad really for the projection front so people will smell you um, I've, I've had people three or four feet away saying what you're wearing after about three hours so it gives you an idea of how the scent portrays in the skin um, but basically what you're looking at is compared to the original, the original was very musky but I've got the original, um, it's very musky just musk, literally any can't smell much more than musk with this, they pulled down the musk a bit pulled up the floral notes which is what I like because I love florals I love florals and um, it's just different it really is different um, yeah as I say in all the reviews um, why would you hate this scent? well, it is linear it's very one dimensional it doesn't really change much at all um, the, only, the only way it changes is it becomes um, less musky more floral the more it goes on in the scent really so after about this is four hours and it's pretty much floral you can just smell a lot of floral it's a different scent completely but it's still linear it doesn't change it's, it's not like you won't be smelling your arm all day going oh it's different it's changing on my skin it won't change in your skin really it'll just be quite linear in that sense um it is simplistic um the bottle is simplistic uh if you like bottles that are a bit extravagant it's not it's just basic, really. Plastic top. Yeah, nothing amazing. It isn't going to stand out, really, in your collection being an amazing bottle. Apart from maybe it spins around. That's pretty cool, I guess. But that's about it. Small things, though. Um, so, yeah, basically, a couple of things to touch on, really, as well, with this one. Um, one is it's very hard to get hold of this. It, it, it took me, a, like, a lot of uh, phone calls and a lot of um, talking to people in fragrance counters, fragrance shops, um, and to get this one, um, because it's really hard to get hold of. Uh, it's unbelievable, really, because I thought it'd be mass market, because they're making it floral, which is basically more mass market than musk. So it's hard to get hold of, but if you can get a hold of it, um, I got mine from the perfume shop in the UK. So yeah, that's where I got mine from, and I had to ring up about, I had to ring up and get them ordered in for me. If you can find it, great. But I struggled to find it really. Um, so something that's hard to get hold of. It's good because people aren't going to be wearing it. But it's bad because it's just an effort to get hold of really. Um, to be honest. So yeah. Um, secondly, this is classed as a a woman's fragrance. This is from the f the female side. Um, and I I disagree completely with that. It's not a female scent. I don't think. Thing is, when you get a floral musk, it's a female scent. It can be portrayed as a masculine scent because that musky, um, mature sort of vibe can come off as a masculine sort of vibe. So for me, this is unisex. I can see a woman wearing this, rocking this completely. I can see a man wearing this. I'd say it's above twenty years old. And the reason why I'm being it is because that musky, mature vibe doesn't really suit a young person, to be honest. Um, unless you like your musky vibes. Don't know. Um, the guys I work with who are like 24, 25, they tend not to like this more uh, because it's not you know fruity, citrusy, aquatic. It's just musky and a bit of floral. But they don't see through that. So, but basically, the idea is, I'd say anywhere above twenty years old. This is a mature sort of scent, really. Um, yeah, it's it's interesting. Um, basically, what I was thinking of. 
when I was thinking of what people think about this, um, three or four hours in, people like it. It's a nice, um, musky scent that people are actually enjoying. They're enjoying smelling it. After that, they can't really smell it. It becomes very close to the skin. And if anything, a, a decent work scent after a few hours. Because it becomes close to the skin and it lasts a while as well. Obviously, seven to eight hours, depending on if you're working out or depending on what position you're in, it can vary really between that. Uh, the overall, I would say this is any uh, anything at any time but summer. This is it really uh, winter fall spring the cold spring days this is really good for that sort of thing it is really uh flexible in the um actual time of the year because you can wear this throughout the year wouldn't wear it in the summer because it can be quite cloying and it, it can not smell nice on you in the heat at all i've tried it in the heat it doesn't it doesn't work at all so anything but the heat this is good for you really which is what i appreciate so overall it's a uh, all season bar summer scent. Uh, you can wear it nighttime, daytime, standard really. It's really good. Um, so we, you're basically getting a huge floral hit for the whole duration, pretty much. That's what you're getting from this scent. Um, to, to sum up, it's just a floral bomb with a lot of musk underneath it as well. So that's what it, that's what it is. That, that's the overall. Um, picture we get for it. It's a decent work scent. If you're going out, you can wear this as well. If you're in close quarters, you can wear this. Just spray it on a three or four hours before. Uh, you don't want to blast them away because it is EDP concentration. Um, so hopefully that's helped. I uh, hope I've answered any questions that you've got really. Uh, if you've got any more questions about the scent, do send me a message or comment. Uh, until then though, I will see you very soon YouTube. Hope you enjoy this scent if you do decide to get it. It's a good one to get anyway. I would recommend it. Alright YouTube, take care. Have a good night.